Hey everybody, welcome to my fictitious laboratory, where today we're going to be talking about what is essentially a bunch of little plant mouths. So, plants breathe kind of like we do, but they breathe through photosynthesis, where they take in carbon dioxide and let out oxygen. Now, for these gases to go back and forth, they have to have pores in their leaves to allow these gases to leave and enter. And those pores are called stomata. So just like our mouths take in oxygen and let out carbon dioxide, their stomata take in carbon dioxide and let out oxygen. So let's take a look. Alrighty, so right here we can actually begin to see some of the stomata at about uh, 40 times magnification. Uh, we actually are looking at the guard cells because the stomata are actually the holes. Um, the guard cells open and close and they allow the plant to give us oxygen and take in CO2 to make oxygen. Um, let's look at a little bit closer now. We're going to look at about a hundred times and you can really easily see the guard cells of the stomata. The stomata um, can vary in size and some of them can be uh, more open or more closed and they actually close and open depending on various environmental factors. Um, all terrestrial plants have stomata but um, most aquatic plants actually don't you can see a pretty good visualization of stomata. There are also more stomata on the underside of all leaves compared to the top side. Um, I'm not quite sure to, as to why that happens, but it is true. And uh, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you guys give a subscribe. And if you like this video, comment and give me some more ideas of what you'd like me to record. Bye!